here is the truth, exactly how I remember it. And perhaps in being so, it is inevitably undone. Here, when the hour is late and the bottle long gone, where thoughts like constellations blur in and out of focus, nothing more than buoyant memory, aqueous melancholy. The shoreline recedes into darkness, the train grains of the past. They catch light of the moon, giving song and sparkle to this late night tale. Here's the truth, I swear, word for word, picking through a pile of sedimentary emotion. The crackle of fire, the cold in my bones and the bitter patter of rain takes me back. Echoes of footfalls crushing fallen leaves. All that's left is a yellow wood, racing back in time, back to where it all started. The beginning of the end. We'd set up camp between risk and consequence, reckless in a way that only youth can know. Our hearts are cursing, pulsing, eager to forge the story of our lives. There was no such thing as a photo without flash, a song without bass, or too much faith in the future. Little did we know. What happened over what is felt is of little consequence. The sheer impact of remaining impervious to desire. You to me. A hen caught by a hook in time, inexplicably attached. Like the dead weight subscription of newspapers in a digital world of click stories and short glass love affairs. The orchestra of our past carries on listlessly. Erratic, yet somehow segwayed. Like time. And all of our choices, embalmed, incubate the senses. The smell of your skin. The smell of your breath. The question of the car in your Outside the Admiral, I inhaled, I exhaled, reflect. Sullied by the desire of what would always and inevitably leave me undone. And that was number one at 66, we're done.